Hello everyone, in this video we're going to be talking about the map of the Crown Tundra and also the returning Pokemon of the Crown Tundra. So this is the spoiler alert because you don't want it to be spoiled then you don't want to uh, carry on going. So we're going to first talk about the returning Pokemon. So now we all know we had these Pokedexes. And everyone got the update so that they could trade for them as well. But yeah, we've got these Pokedexes that we can fill out. And we're going to be talking about the new Pokedexes for the Crown Tundra. Which mainly consists of legendaries and rare Pokemon. Which has no surprise. So let's just go right there. On Twitter, ABC Boy has found a full list of the new pokemon that are going to be in the crown tundra which is very very likely to be true that which is something that we've figured out so let's just go on to that list right now so the list is the nidoran family the crobat golbat those things you've got electabuzz you've got jinx a lot of fossils have come. Kabuto, you've got Kabutops, you've got Zapdos, Moltres, Articuno, Dragonairs, Dragonites, and you've got Agrons, you've got all of the Hoenn starters, you've got some of the Johto legendaries there. You've got a lot of the Pokemon and legendaries from the Hoenn region. And you've got mythicals and other things as well, including the Ultra Beasts. Many people have said that the Ultra Beasts are probably coming in an event. So, yeah, that's probably very likely as well. So, you, you want to expect that it's coming in an event. And that is the list. So now let's move on to the map. Of course, we've got our map from here. We've got this map and this map, right? But the Crown Tundra is actually probably going to be under the Isle of Armour down here. And we know that Sonya's going to be there too, because I've deciphered that since she is not in her regular place, and something that Hop said just gave it away right away, Hop had said that... He had chosen to explore the Isle of Armour, which I'm going to show you right now, even though I said I'd show it before. But yeah, in this picture that I took on my second walkthrough of the game, it says Sonia and I split up places to survey, and she opted for the cold and snow and all. So that means she's in the Crown Tundra, and that is most likely her location at the moment. Um, now let's actually go back to the map and what the crown tundra will look like this guy called matt actually found um the crown tundra's map so let's go on to the video he posted of it and there we have it this is slowpoke's habitat although it's not very clear you can see the waves you can see a few of the checkpoints you can see a lot of stuff here you can see it's at, no, no, it's actually below mainland Galar. Oh, wow. And, yeah, that is Slowpoke's location in the Crown Tundra. Let's try this ourselves. So we're going to go to Slowpoke and look for its location. No, we can't see it. We cannot see it, so he must have broken the game somehow into tracking him in, or maybe he got an update like that. But apparently there's going to be um, stuff like fly locations to Reggie Drago's chamber, Reggie Alecki's chamber, um, a lot of the Reggie chambers, the place where you do your max raid adventures, and maybe there's going to be one for where you start like we start at this place and then we go to the dojo something like that's going to happen there as well at least that's what i suspect 
so let's end the video thank you for watching please like and subscribe to my videos for more content like this and i will try to make sure to cover things like this in the future as well so thank you for watching bye